So this question looks like a translate word problem question. Uh, I say that given the length of the question. And all it means in terms of all this strategy is telling us is that we want to write down any quantitative information, any other relevant information while reading versus reading the entire thing and having to go back to find the quantitative and relevant information. So this question starts off by saying when Arbon walks from home to class, he burns 4.2 calories per minute. And when he rides his bike from home to class, he burns 5.1 calories per minute. So how do I translate that? I'm going to turn walking into a variable. So I'm going to say W equals 4.2 cal per minute. And biking, B equals 5.1 cal per minute. The next sentence says, if Arbon spent a total of two hours walking and biking, bicycling, so I'm going to also convert that or translate that. So given my variables, that would mean that W, right, plus B in terms of time is equal to, now I'm going to call this 120 minutes instead of, instead of two hours. And that's just because we're using minutes over here, right? So converting hours to minutes, I think is best. On this test, you always want to have consistency with your unit. So if you ever see some switch like we just saw here, right, from a per minute to hours, just make sure they're the same. Um, so... Arbon spent a total of two hours walking and bicycling from home to class in a week and burned a total of 531 calories. Okay, well, how do you burn the calories? Well, however much time you're walking, you multiply that by 4.2, or however many minutes you're walking, you multiply by 4.2. However many minutes you're bicycling, you multiply that by 5.1, and you get the total number of calories, so 531. How many minutes did he spend walking? So the question's asking, what's the value of W? Okay, so we can see here that we have a system of equations. This system of equations arises from translating the actual question. So I'm gonna use the process called substitution to solve this system. I'm gonna take this original or this first equation and solve for B by subtracting W from both sides. So I end up with B equals 120 minus W. Now, why did I do that? I do that because now that I know B equals 120 minus W, I can replace this B here with 120 minus W, and I end up with an equation, 4.2W plus 5.1, parentheses, 120 minus W, equals 531 that only contains a single variable w which is exactly the variable that i'm looking to find so now all that i have left is to simplify this i'm going to bring this down where i have more space so 4.2 w if i distribute this here let me see pull out my calculator 5.1 times 120 is let me just do that 5.1 times 120 is 612, so we get equals, so 4.2 W equals, I'm sorry, plus, not equals, plus 612 minus, distribute that, 5.1 W equals 531. I have like terms here, 4.2 W minus 5.1 W gives me negative 0.9 W plus 612 equals 531. I can then subtract 612 from both sides, and I get negative 0.9 W equals negative 81. And then I just divide both sides by negative 0.9, and I get that W, right, the amount of time spent walking, is equal to 90 minutes. We don't track our units on this test, so just 90 will be the answer here.